guys, it's me, your girl Yodiko here, and it's been far too long. I am finally able to record. My game is finally able to save. I got rid of some stuff. So you may see little changes in the house. Luckily for her lot, not a lot left from the amount that I deleted. So we are in good cookie sailings here, baby. So last episode, I know it was like Mother's Day or something. Um, and that was before the high school years and I have high school years. So we're not going to do this, do that with her for the most part. I may take her to school maybe once. We're probably going to send her alone for the most part and just cut that out. And if I feel like something significant needs to happen to the story, we'll take her to school. Um, honestly, for this day, I might take her to school. Because it is Father's Day, so we're going to, of course, interact with Gail. And I think it would be a good thing for her to go to school. And if Gail shows up as one of her classmates for school, then I'll keep it in. If he doesn't, we'll say they're going to do something. Well, they're going to do something after school regardless. We're just going to say it's going to skip to them doing something at school. So, of course, we're going to do all her little maintenance Piper's still cute or whatever. Look at her looking cute. The babies are still babying. I love them. Um, the other things that are gone. She'll clean this too. She's about to go to school, so I gotta hurry up. So some of my um almost all of our day one rabbits died. I am like Daisy, Bumble. And I just got I just I just got something from them. And then after I got the gifts from them, they died. Nacho, Cheeto, Muffin, gone. Corn's still around, but Corn's kind of stuck in this limbo, being stuck in this spot. So I'm guessing Corn's going to be gone soon. We're going to have to meet all new bunnies soon. Oh my gosh, we finally got a hatchable egg. When does it hatch? I'll talk to Taro because everybody's dying. I am so sad. This buddy like gifts. I mean like books. Did you want a mushroom? Let's give him one of the mushrooms. I think corn's dying, bro. I think corn's gonna die. Ha! That kind of give a gift. So we ain't giving um Gail, nothing. Because we gave a gift to the chicken. I mean, to the bunny. Teddy always trying to be next to uh, Lucy while she getting milked. Leave her alone. And an iconic photo, of course, because this world is just beautiful. Ooh, look at Janus. Janice watching this. Who that Richard? Richard over here watching us too, I guess. Oh, he plopped down to sit. How cute. Okay, so the babies are still all asleep. Let's check their. Okay, Matthew needs to go potty when he wakes up. I guess that's now. That's now. Oh, everybody's so sad. All the bunnies are freaking dying. And then Matthew can come down and eat this egg salad. Don't know. Did I call him Matthew? That's Ethan. Oh my gosh. Ethan needs to, Matthew now needs to go to the bathroom. Ethan is the one that's eating the egg salad and just use the bathroom. He don't need to eat, but he does need to play. So we'll have him come play with some cars. And Sophia, ooh, child, you got to pee, baby. Everybody's so so sad about these bunnies. Me too. I did not know that they were gonna, it was going to end like this. 
Um, baby Raven, she don't have to pee too much. So we're just going to have her come down. And she's kind of open with her taste. Let's see if she... Let's get her some chicken and waffles. Mommy. Mommy's out here doing some more of this. I'm going to have her do some laundry as well. Wash in the wash tub. Finish hugging all your animals. I'm tempted to bring the waste basket. Not the waste basket. Oh my gosh. I'm tempted to bring the dirty laundry down and put it in this room, being that now our pantry is completely empty. Enjoy. Not in front of the children. Not Attack on Titan. You could at least get all that host club, ma'am. Oh my gosh, please come down here so your mommy can give you comfort. She sure will. She sure will. She's playing cards. Okay, so hopefully Sophia gets down here so she can give her some comfort because she's so sad about those bunnies. Poor thing. Honestly, same because... What? Girl, get up and comfort your baby. Not to attack on Titan being loud. Oh, here come Eden. Oh my goodness! Comfort her again. Comfort her again so I can get a photo. Stop it. She's acting like he ain't got no sense. Not Aaron in the background about punching a punching a Titan. Oh, what are you doing? I think he just running. This will be a great thumbnail. Look at little Matthew. Look at him, he's so cute. Okay, so now she's going to go to school, so I'll see you guys there. Okay, so we have made it to high school. Gail is here, Emmett's not here, but he might show up because I do have the more visitors for more high school students to show up. So we may see Gail. I mean, not Gail. We may see Emmett, but there's Gail. So we do need to speak with him. I don't know where she's going and what she's doing. This is just to satisfy Gail's Father's Day. Whatever. Um, her brother is here, though. So I'm going to have her come hug her brother. Lara's standing within us. Let's give Lara a huggy hug. And we're not going to spend much time here. Because like I said, well, let's ask her about her college. Is she planning on going to college? Because our girl's not going to college. She's doing good right off the farm. But I think Emmett's going to go to college. And I want Emmett to join the household so bad. But I think I'm going to wait. I think his brother's like, no. Graduate high school. And then... You can do what you want from that point on. But you have my stipulation. You have to go to college. Cuties. Oh, my gosh. Look at her little belly. It's so cute. The best friend's best thing. They haven't had a best friend's day. So we need to do that, too. And I guess we should find Gail and be like, happy Father's Day. Even though you don't come see your kids as often as you should. But here we are. Happy Father's Day. We gotta go find the principal too. All right, let's look for some Father's Day interactions. We won't complain. We love celebrating Father's Day, let's be real. Cause we need to go see her dad. Oh, hey gal. Lars looking at him like, mm. Hey, happy Father's hey, Day. I hope you have a great day. And he's looking like, oh, you actually wish me happy Father's Day? That's 
the children's father. If you don't remember from the first episode, that is the children's father. Matthew, Ethan, Sophia, and Raven's dad. That's why they have such strong features, because she has such girly, soft features. She's got a little strong features. I love her little nose and her little big lips. And then they get most of their jawline from their daddy. Mm. I feel like Matthew is going to look more like his dad than any of them. Like, for sure. For sure. Definitely. So let's just... Um, let's ask what his favorite cake and stuff is. Dubow. We don't like him very much, so I don't know how this is going to go. And Emma's not here, so I don't like that either. Oh, we need to claim a locker. Look at our brother. Look at Donovan. Looking all cute. He looks so grown. He looked like such a, like, teen baby. But now he looks so grown. Oh, my gosh. This is so uh, cute. Baby dad. I don't like how him and Lara was talking to each other, but I doubt Lara would ever betray like that, you know? She's the day one. She's in the day one club, you know? Okay, guys, let's break it up. It's time to go to class. Okay, so I will see you guys after she gets... Let's see what class she's going to be in. Oh, she front and center. What class is this? Social studies. Okay. All right. I will see you guys after class. Okay. Bye. So the girls, class is over. We got what we needed. I'm trying to introduce myself to this principal. Let's just do a respectful introduction. Like, forget it. Hey girls, I'll see you in the cafeteria. Okay, bye. And then let's come up here and let's sit together. And then she's gonna order an entree because she's hungry. And she said, um, I'm like hungry, hungry. So she's gonna get this spicy deluxe. The spicy, no, the grill, no. I want her to get spicy. Yeah, let's get the Chick-fil-A spicy deluxe sandwich. And let's order a drink. Um, we'll get the, do they have the half and half? Cause that's what I get. I don't know, she doesn't seem like a half and half type of girl. She seems like she would get a lemonade. Oh my gosh, the girls are coming. She is so pretty. Why are you sipping it like that when I got a straw, baby? Yum, yum, yum. So she's currently studying for her exam. Okay, so at this point, I will catch you guys when school is over. There's not much else to do here. Like I said, I don't really want to explore it that much in her save. This is just so you can see her interact with Gail. And just a little backstory before we do the Father's Day festivities. Okay, so our girl made it back home. Unfortunately, it's like 6 p.m. So it's way after school. But hear me out. Her homework's done. She's good in this. Oh, our chickens are doing what they're supposed to be doing. Um, and we are going to take dad, uh, mom, Gail. We're bringing Emmett. We're bringing Emmett. Gail, Emmett, out. Um, we may include Emmett's brother, older brother. And we're going to take them all out for Father's Day. <laughs> Sophia. <laughs> Sophia, please, baby. It never fails. She never fails to make a mess. Oh, look. What's going on, Ethan? 
Now, what's really going on? Where are you going? Ethan. Ethan. Where is he going? And we're following Ethan because Ethan decided he's coming out here to do something in the nature. And I don't know what it's going to be. Let's follow Ethan. Let's see what Ethan's doing. But yeah, we're about to go to dinner. The baby's going to have to, the babies are going to come. So we're going to have to try to find a restaurant. Where are you going, Ethan? Guess it's just follow a toddler. Look at his little pants. Look at him. I don't understand. I just don't understand. This is gorgeous. Where are we going, Ethan? What's the tea? Him walking through the flowers is just the cutest little thing. She's still making her mess. Okay, so he didn't do anything. Aw, Raven. Aw, look at Raven in her PJs. I love the babies. Sophia decided to stop or she was finished. One of the two. Most likely it was because she was finished. They are supposed to, I, they're going to be the best of friends, okay? <laughs> Sophia's like, what, what's going on in here? All right, so my game did crash all the way back to when they was back in the house, so I got everybody back. But this time around, I decided to bring Donovan, and I decided to bring Renee. I was going to bring Adrian, but I didn't realize I didn't add Gail, so it was like, this is about Gail. And we already placed the orders... Um, we're just waiting on it. It was about $400, $500. Um, what we did is that we gave the babies. Matthew ate his sandwich. They all got ham and cheese sandwiches. So now we're just waiting on the food and stuff. There are so many waiters here. What an interesting. Um, I'm going to attempt introduction. What? You don't know his grandmother? Now, hold on. Okay, so then he'll go ahead and start talking to grandmother. Talk about party. Okay, and then next we'll do Sophia. They up there acting a fool. Talk to your grandpa. Apparently, they don't know their grandparents. When? When did this happen? Raven, <laughs> talk to your dad. Why are you talking to this waiter? Please stop talking to this waiter and talk to your father. Yeah, talk to your dad and talk to your mom, Piper, or something. Like, what the frank? Talk to anybody else. Oh, my gosh. I love that they're outside. This is such a vibe. It's like they're outside in the city. This is Newcrest. <gasps> that was fast. I feel bad because I get the babies their food so quickly. All right, so let's look at the food. He got the, I think the bombu hue. She got sashimi. He got the shalong bao. Wagyu. Champong. A salad noise. Mom got the Beijing roast duck. And he got the doujong jike. Okay. And they each got a drink, some, she got a Sprite, he got a Coke. 
white wine, Gail, um, Gail, Piper, and Emmett all got Long Island iced teas. He got him a Casamigos, red wine, a Monte Vista. And then mommy got the Riesling. That food came fast. What's the quality? Normal? Mm, normal? Mm. Normal? 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 No excelente? Mom's food was poor. Oh my gosh, that's why she's not eating. What kind of five star restaurant is this? Piper's so pretty. Emmett's so pretty. Nathan's here with his brother because he raised Emmett, so she felt appropriate. Daddy Kins. Looking just like her daddy. Baby Daddy Kins. I feel like Sophia looks like him the most. Mommy Kins. With the boobies out, of course. Brother and sister Kins. I can't wait until she turns into a teenager. She will be turning into a teenager very soon. So we'll see her at school too. Because I consider her like 13, 14. So she, she'll be coming to ninth grade soon enough. Okay, so they are almost all done eating. Yes, ma'am, what do you have in your hand? It's the dang apple juice. Dad's not eating his food. Mom said, I'm not about to eat this. I don't know what happened here, but it glitched and perfect. So everybody go hug your dad. Hug your father. Hug, hug, hug. Come hug your dad. Everybody come hug Papa San. What's wrong, Ethan? Oh, Matthew did it first. Hugging daddy. Matthew looks like that too. Matthew, move back so your brother can move back. Your brother's trying to hug Papa San, and Sissy's gonna try to hug him too. I mean, whoever gets here. There we go. Hug daddy. Although he's over here telling the craziest story to... She's so pretty. And last but not least, she looked just like her dad, just a little more tan. Okay, all the babies are good. They are solid. I think they are solid. Cutie patooties and solid. She's not going to go back to Gail. Gail was the fun guy, and the fun got too real, you know? They could take this poor roast duck out of here. Oh. Sir, do your job. Oh, she's so cute. Oh, she's so cute. She got the same nose. They got the same nose. She got her daddy nose. You see how they look like their daddy? Squared out jaw. Definitely got daddy nose. Look at that nose. Ooh. Daddy nose. Ooh. Daddy nose. Ooh. She got more of her nose. She got a little big nose too. 
Mommy, you pregnant? Is no. mommy pregnant? She look a little pregnant right there. She ain't pregnant, is she? Oh, we are the three children. I'm so stupid. Mommy is pregnant. I got her a drink. No wonder why she ain't drinking it. Girl, come drink this from your mother. Oh my gosh, it's 12 o'clock. Oh my gosh, we need to go home and we need to go to bed. Drink this drink and we going home. Such a wonderful Father's Day. $487 for 12 guests. Let's be real. It was a little bit more, so maybe like $500 because I had to buy them each some sandwiches and the apple juice. But I'm going to go ahead and have her disband the group. And we are all, we are heading home. It was nice to see you all. It was nice to love you all. But who's she gonna pick up? Oh. Mommy was not that pregnant when she got here. She must have just gotten to her second trimester. Cause mommy did not look like this when she showed up. Oh, we're picking up Sophia this time. All right, so I'll catch you guys back at the place, back at the house, bye. All right, so we made it back home. So now this is the time where I'm gonna have her. She never really does this and they always do it themselves. She is going to tuck in all the babies because this was just such an eventful day. Unless they got to go to the bathroom. No, they don't. We're going to say they sleepy because ain't no way. Ask her to put you to sleep. I'm going to have all the other babies walk up here. So that they can be up here. Ooh, Piper gained some followers. All the other babies are walking. Let's go. Let's put Tyler to bed, which is Raven. <laughs> What's going on? Okay. So, how about I just do this. They all go to bed and she'll just tuck them in. Go to sleep. We should have invited Gail so Gail can help tuck in the babies, put the babies to sleep, and then told him to go home. But it's too late at night. We ain't giving him no hopes because the last time we invited him over, she almost got her butt pregnant again. I think that was before she was with Emmett, technically. Tuck the babies in. I know, ma'am. I know. We're so tired. Too cute. Yes, ma'am. Okay, so now she's like... She's going to take her a rose petal bath, and then she is going to sleep, okay? No, she should write in her journal and then go to sleep. Yep, homework's done. All of that's done. Okay, so we're gonna say this is Piper writing about her eventful day. Because it was pretty crazy. She's just like, 
I went to the new school that opened. Me and Gail are kind of on okay terms, but I still don't want to lose him. The babies love him. My parents still kind of like him. Everybody's still with him, but they know like how he just kind of went ghost. Didn't want the babies, but I think he's coming around. Father's Day was pretty good. Still smitten with Emmett. So here we are. Just writing your journal, girl. Daddy was happy. Mommy was happy. Even Emmett's brother was happy. It was just a good old meal, a good old grand time, and happy she used her earnings to pay for the dinner. So she will catch you guys in the morning. All right, so our girl is up. She is working on some house maintenance. I know it's Wednesday and I usually like to reserve this for Sundays, but I'm tired of her walking in the house saying something stank and I don't know what's stanking. To be quite honest with you, maybe it's the trash or something, but something is stinking to her. Where is there another plate? Who put dishes on the rabbits? Lord. Somebody put dishes on the rabbits. I don't understand why my plants never need to be watered. We'll come back and we'll collect eggs. I think corn's dying next and that's sucks for me. I don't have as many bunnies. Can I just call random rabbits out? I don't have them in my life anymore. Generate some more bunnies game. Jeez. Oh lord. There's something to clean up there. Butters is still here y'all. Butters is still here. I thought he died. Who died then? Cheeto. Cheeto died. Damn, Cheeto. Okay, so let's get the babies together. So who has to pee the most? Okay. Raven doesn't have to pee as often as the other babies. Oh, the babies are up. Okay. Nobody's hungry, which is good. She's a little hungry. I'll let Raven get some more sleep while we wait for all the babies to... Um, Ethan's probably going to be the first one done. So, do we have anything snackish? I don't think we have any snackish foods. Let's go here and let's say, let's cook a custom meal. Now let's speed this up. You have class soon, so you need to be very careful. That looks delicious. That looks like exactly what I'm looking for. No, you're gonna come down and grab you a serving of that. Miss Ma'am is gonna come and go potty. Mr. Sir, you are not going to do that. I think you also will grab a serving. Yeah, all of you grab a serving of this. Keep your hands busy. Where is the trash? She's going to have her a serving of that. Cow cuddles, that's so cute. I don't think she's gonna be able to eat and use the bathroom before she goes. We're gonna try. Okay, so for the most part, I think I'm not gonna follow her to school this time. Should I? I wanna see if Emmett shows up. Nope, nope, nope. We're not following her to school. I'm gonna send her alone to go do her schooly things. Go ahead, 
Piper. All right, so Piper's off to school. So we'll see her when she gets back. The babies will be here with the babysitter. And yeah, catch you guys then. Be there 